Hey guys, how are we all doing? Happy Sunday, everybody. Hope you guys are all having a good weekend. Um, this is our Binance update. So we'll see our, well, it's, it's our Binance and MXC in three commas update. So we'll at, go over and have a look, see how they are all getting on. Um, we've got to do, <laughs> um, MXC decided it was going to delist um, DOS, um, which we had quite a, a decent position in. That was, um, it was about three, uh, three Xing um so we've got a bit more uh, a bit a bit of complicated work out at the moment so what we've got to do um to work out the full balance is um we've got this balance initially two two point um zero point two six two bitcoin but we have got if we have a look in here i've got to actually search it to show you um dos um is it going to show me high zero value so it's saying it's a zero value coin but it's not obviously um but it's just zero value on their platform you can only withdraw it you can't deposit or trade it so we are going to have to um work out um basically what this is worth i have actually because i this is just a, a youtube account um i've got my main account that i did all, all deal with this today i basically um withdrew the dos sent it over to i had to set up a bitmax account because they trade it on bitmax and that's bitmax not bitmex um, so yeah, we work out what this is. So we've got 1,209, well, 1,000, sorry, we've got 12,980, we'll call it these 85 coins. And these coins, I mean, if we look over here on the Bitmax website, um, you can see it's, it's looking pretty strong. It was, it was up at 70, um, before, so that's not too bad just because we basically bought it at two. Um, so that's not bad. And so if we go over to here, we'll be able to get a BTC value um so this is it we're gonna times it by this so one two three four five noughts five four seven um so where's my calculator so multiplied by five noughts um one two three four five and five four seven wasn't it yeah it's just there five four seven so that gives us a total of 0 0.07 btc in that asset so that's good so we will add that to um our um 2.62 i did just refresh that i'll refresh it again just in just just to check just for full full efficacy um come on come on come on yeah 2.62 the same so plus um 0.262 so our mxc should be at 0 0.33 um and then our binance binance has ticked up a little bit which is good uh binance is at um come on come on 0 0.655 we'll call it 0 0.657 um plus 0 0.657 so we are just under just under the one whole bitcoin at the moment so i'm quite pleased with that because alts have been getting hammered um even still a lot of the whole alts that were holding getting hammered and it's, it's taken a couple of um a couple of like basic coins that have um two three and four x to keep us above water but that's it that's good if you make the big wins um they can obviously make up for a lot of small losses and then when those uh i mean we're not aiming to make small losses on any of these coins but whilst they are taking losses um then the big wins are obviously helping us so it's good to, i'm glad, glad to see that game back also what we have got helping us also is we've got no active orders at the moment but you can see our three commas bots have been pumping away um so they made nearly 200 dollars in extra um extra well extra dollar value and extra usdd usdt um so yeah they've been working really well um so i'm really pleased with those um so yeah the bots have been doing well so that's that's nearly another two percent um extra that we've got from that but yeah so we are doing our best by picking some coins that are forexing i know forexing not, not like not like the foreign exchange but just as in the number four or we call it three xing couple of coins some coins that are three xing um and then three commons bot helping us so i did a little bit a little bit of business today i am going to sell this dos once um, i'm going to sell this dos um when i transfer it over to a bit max and then what i'll probably do is then um yeah sell that transfer the dos over to bitmax sell the sell it on bitmax for btc and then i'll send the btc back to our mxc uh and M mxc here and then we'll be back in business with just the two accounts so that is what i will do um also what i want to show yeah the, the little bit of business we did <laughs> a 
a little bit of business. So what we did was we um, um I sold some of the QLC. We had quite a big QLC position that I bought down here. Um, I actually bought this based on on uh, my indicator, the TWD VPV risk range, which stands for trading with Dan volume, price, volatility, risk range. Um, so I bought it at the bottom here. Um, and obviously it's had quite a nice pump up so I actually did take it off at uh, it was about it was 257 I think so I took it off, off off when this spike started to come back down so it has some subsequently moved down a little bit but that's fine so anyway we've taken some of this QLC coin off um, half of it off uh, left half of it on still and I actually put it into Kyber Networks because I do think Kyber Networks is a good uh, coin and it is, it is, um, it's basically had a bit of a, a pump down, a bit of a, a, a candle wick, and now we're sort of trading here. So, um, I am bullish of this coin. Um, let's go, if I take it off for I can see a bit more in the context of what's happening. I do believe we are going to start to make a, make a move back up again. That is my, that is my view, my non-financial advice view. Um, so yeah, so I've actually bought some more carbon network. So if you actually go into here, you can see we hold quite a bit more carbon network. We still got, um, IXRLC. RLC. Um, got quite a lot of REN and then synthetics. We did sell some synthetics, remember? Um, <clears throat> because because synthetics um, has gone on a nice little mission as well, if I just show you guys. And it's still going on. It's still going on. So, yeah, I mean, we we had synthetics synthetics from lower and it's obviously pumped up. So I did, I've been taking a um, little bit of stuff on the way up. And we now have... Um, and now we only have that much left. Um, Avelem, we've got that. MCO, we've still got that. Tezo's got that. Cosmos got that. Um, Zero X, we've still got that. Engine Coin, Carver, Carver. Um, we might um, look to get some more in there. There's our remaining QLC. We took half of that off, and then we got Decentraland. Um, so yeah, so that is it, guys. I am quite pleased with that pullback. Um, <laughs> the bots have been trading their ass off to make some of that back. Um, I've been uh well i say lucky i mean we had a whole basket of coins that i but that are potentially high risk and, and a couple of them have popped off um over the past um the world well, past week so um that's helped us a bit um so all in all i'm pretty pleased i think we'll be back in the positive bitcoin is obviously a lot higher as well so we'll be we'll be back up in bitcoin value and fiat value bearing in mind we've been trading alts which have been getting hammered so um i am pleased with that progress and once alt start to get shown some love then yeah it will be an altcoin party and i pretty quickly expect to be at like 25 percent up on these altcoins and nearly then 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 get into half, half a percent half a uh, 50 percent up and um half a bitcoin up that's kind of what i expect to happen so there you go guys remember not a financial advice i'm not a financial advisor uh always do your own research and i'll speak to you guys later on with our bitcoin daily wrap